Okay, now I'm going to go ahead and demonstrate the animation program I put together for the Vector Custom Cube. I'm going to go ahead and load up an animation that I've already demonstrated in another video, the Angry Face video. And when I click this button, it'll transmit it to the IP address of the cube, and you'll be able to see it on the screen. I can cycle through the animation to show what the frames look like. Here you can determine the fill color and the duration for each frame that you add. This section allows you to cycle through the frames, move them back and forth, and update their durations and fill colors. And the section over here is where you deal with the primitives that make up the animation. So for instance, I can add a new circle to the screen by selecting a color for it and clicking Add Circle. And then you have a circle that you can move around and resize. And you can also manipulate the values here and update them.